Here we are given the definition of an imaginary number i is equal to the square root of minus 1 and we are asking to find the value of i to the power of 2016. So we want to find the value of i to the power of a large number. So before solving this problem, maybe we can start calculating i to the power of some small numbers and we'll see if we have a pattern that we can use to solve this problem. We can try to calculate i to the power of 0 and we know that any number to the power of 0 is equal to 1 except 0 to the power of 0 so i to the power of 0 is equal to 1 and i to the power of 1 is of course equal to itself which is i and i square is then equal to the square root of minus 1 square and the square root and square here they can cancel out each other so we have i square is equal to minus 1 and to calculate i cube we can use the properties of exponent to write i cube as the product of i square times i to the power of 1 and since i square is equal to minus 1 so we have i cube is equal to minus 1 times i which is equal to minus i so i cube is equal to minus i and using the properties of exponent we can say that i to the power of 4 as the product of i square and i square and since i square is equal to minus 1 then i to the power of 4 is equal to minus 1 times minus 1 which is equal to 1 and from this result we can see that i to the power of 4 has the same result as i to the power of 0 and we can say that the result is starting to repeat first we have 1 i minus 1 minus i and then here we have 1 again and we can try to calculate i to the power of 5 to see that we do have a repeating pattern and we use the properties of exponent we can write i to the power of 5 as the product of i to the power of 4 times i to the power of 1 and since we have i to the power of 4 as 1 then we have the result is 1 times i which is equal to i and from this result we can see that the pattern starts to repeat and from this we can say that the pattern starts to repeat for every fourth power so after the fourth power the pattern starts to repeat we can also say that the pattern repeats for every fourth power we can use this pattern to solve our problem since we want to calculate i to the power of 2016 and we know that the pattern repeats for every fourth power and we can divide 2016 by 4 and we know 2016 divided by 4 is 504 without any remainder or with zero remainder and this zero remainder is telling us that the result of i to the power of 2016 is equal to i to the power of zero so the result is equal to one so the answer for this problem is c and using this pattern we can find the value of i to the power of any number with dividing the power by 4 and see what the remainder is and this remainder let's say that if we have a one remainder then the result of our value will be equal to i to the power of 1 if we have two remainder then the result will be equal to the i square and if we have remainder 3 then the result will be equal to the i cube so using this pattern we can find the value of i to the power of any number easier